clearly the Democrats' priorities are way out of whack here, way out of whack. Uh, you see that also related to border security, things that they all supported in the past, every prominent Democrat uh, they now uh, oppose. So I would say this is a little bit of a, uh, a challenging beginning uh, to the new year, but we'll work our way through it. We certainly will not be in recess next week if the government is still shut down. Well, it may surprise you, you know, I haven't been following every utterance of Congressman King, uh, but I certainly followed this one, and I think the House Republican uh, Conference did the right thing. Okay, good afternoon, everybody. Now, as the Trump shutdown drags on, more and more Americans are getting hurt. Public servants have been working without pay. Critical agencies are unable to perform their functions. Let the president see the pain the Trump shutdown is causing. He'd benefit from listening to their stories of federal civil servants who are working without pay, locked out of their jobs, Maybe then tre President Trump will understand the damage he's causing by holding these people hostage until he gets what he wants. Meanwhile, Leader McConnell, Senate Republicans are hiding in the shadows as if they have some kind of aversion to doing their job when it involves even the slightest break with the President. 